The following video asks us to factor the quadratics, um, and we're going to use the trial and error method. I know there are other ways to do it, but I, I in general like to just teach a trial and error method because I think it creates the best understanding. So in this case, we start our two parentheses because a quadratic always factors into two binomials. We realize that x times x is going to give us our x squared, which is what we're looking there for there. Then we look at the last term, which is 3, and we know that we need to multiply two things together to get 3. Now, one of the things you look at is you look at the, plus, the, the signs of the x term and the number. If they're both positive, then you know in your factorization they're both going to be positive. So you can see here we did x times x to get x squared, we did 3 times 1 to get 3. Now we've taken care of the 3's, so now we have to check is if that works uh, in the middle. So we check to see if you know we have x times 1 is x and 3x, 3 times x is 3x, and yes, the using x plus 3 times x plus 1 does give us the correct um, x term. So our answer is x plus 3 times x plus 1. There wasn't a lot of trial and error. You really only had one option on this problem. Now in the next one you have more than one option because again you're going to have x times x to get x squared. However, there are other, there are, um, you could get 14 times 1 or 7 times 2 to get 14. Now again we've got a plus and a plus and so inside our parentheses we know we have plus and a plus because we need a plus 14 and a plus 9 so everything needs to be plus. But in this case, do we want to choose 14 and 1, or do we want to choose 7 and 2? And you have to make this decision. Now, the good thing is, you don't have to make it correct the first time, because if it's not correct, you'll know. But we're going to try 7 and 2, so we multiply, we, we know x times x is x squared, 7 times 2 is 14, so we multiply the other two terms, x times 2, which is 2x, 7 times x, which is 7x, add those together, and yes, we have our 9x, which is what we needed as that middle term. So x times x is the x squared, 7x plus 2x is a 9x, and 2 times 7 is 14. So the answer is x plus 7 times x plus 2.